the main study everyone kind of points to is this like rugby player study where they loaded for a week, I think, and then they use a maintenance dose for another two weeks. And again, it's not like they had hair loss in the study. It was just they noticed their DHT levels went up significantly compared to the placebo group. They all went bold at the end. (laughs) (laughs) So in this study in particular, we see the guys who took creatine, they have a notable bump in their DHT levels, but their testosterone levels do not change significantly from what i recall off the top of my head it was just like no conclusion as to if it for sure increases dhd and i think what is happening at most is potentially just pushing you closer to the if i'm prone it could happen side of things because Mm. of the upregulation in dhd production potentially but you could still fact check that yourself with blood work like you could get a dhd baseline take a bunch of creatine do your loading phase get a blood test done see where your dhd is at if it hasn't changed yeah, not no harm, no foul.